Hey, Moses here from MGTOW Mafia. It's great to be back. I recently had an interesting phone conversation. I think you guys are going to be able to relate to this conversation really well. So I told this girl a lot of information she already knew about, but she doesn't want to accept it. So your opinions and your views and questions and comments are all welcome in the text box. So I'm going to protect the identity of this female but at the same time, you get to see the way females act because this is reality. This is the way they really talk to a male in order to try to get them to marry or to go further in a relationship. This is exactly how they act and you can learn something by listening. I just want to be with you because I'm in love with you. No other reason. I don't need your house. I don't not ask you for sex. It's nothing. I just wanted to be with you. That's it. That was the whole thing. And I'm in love with you, and I just wanted to be with you, and then I'm not trying to take anything from you. Yes, that's like that. Oh, I'm so right. You get scared. Everyone gets scared. Some people don't get scared. Some people stick around. I'm not trying to get anything from you. I wasn't even trying to get pregnant from you because I was so scared you were going to do something stupid and get me pregnant and I kept coming to warn you so I'm not even trying to do that or trick you into anything. So you're pulling me away but at that point you feel you can't handle it and do that. What? I said I feel very close to you and if you feel like you have to pull away because you can't handle it then pull away. You're grown man, you can decide what you want to do. Well, I need a little space because I'm getting drained. I know, because you're feeling too close to me and you're scared. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm scared you're going to get attached. Because it's normal to be attached to someone after you sleep with them and spend time with them and eat dinner with them and take showers with them. Yeah, that's a normal reaction. If you were, if you didn't have that reaction, you wouldn't be a human. You'd be inhuman. And your family is telling you to like be careful that I'm going to do something to you. I don't know what I'm going to do to you. I bet your dad didn't say that. I just want to remain on focus. What if I get taken off focus? What kind of focus? What is once a week going to do to you? What do you want from me? I what? don't know. I told you what I wanted from you. You didn't. You said no, so I don't know what we're doing. You said. What is it that you want? Tell me. So what do you think I want from you? I think you just want to get married. Okay. To anybody. Mm-hmm. And I don't have anyone else to marry but you. You're the only man around. And you're the only man who wants to marry me. No, I don't want to get married. What? I don't want to get married. You don't have to get married. I'm not getting married. I'm in monk mode. You're not getting married ever. You told me that already. You told me to find another man to marry. Remember? All right. Yep. You told me I should have sex with you and find someone else to marry. I already know that. Okay, so then why are you getting mad then? I'm not mad, I'm just hurt. Oh. There's a difference. If you're hurt, why did you see me? Because I still love you, even though you hurt me. Oh. All right. You sent me a gift. What? Did you send this to me? No. That must be the other man. That's my brother. There you have it, my friends. I gave you a little piece of my life. The previous phone conversation was real. There were no actors involved. So I want you to please hit that subscribe button and smash the like. And I want everyone to have a great day. I'm going to say so long for now. This is Moses from MGTOW Mafia. Thank you for viewing my video. Bye-bye now.